I'm Sarah Bartram. My passion in life is music and dance, and I want to be able to share that with as many people as possible, be it if you are a musician already or you're someone that doesn't know anything about music. I want to share my education and knowledge with you. I decided to pursue music because I had some wonderful teachers in high school and middle school that I wanted to be like them. Everything started in Michigan. Well, that's one really good thing about growing up in the Midwest is that we have tons of music programs. And I got really lucky. I went to Adrian College, which is about 40 minutes away from University of Michigan. And some of our professors actually teach at both schools. I was able to have music theory with you know, five students. And I had a lot of individual attention that I, I really needed. And, and it, it, was, it was great. They brought a high school band in to play for us, and it must have been kindergarten, first grade. And the band director had all, you know, every student stand up and say, this is this instrument section, and he had the flute section stand up and do their little demonstration, and then he had the piccolo player stand up and do hers, and he said, you know, to play that instrument, you have to be really good at flute. Like, you have to be the best of the best, and and this is extremely hard. And there was something about the sound. It was just this little tiny instrument, but it was so powerful and shrill and, and you could hear it miles away that I was just like, I wanna play that. <laughs> uh, I got involved in dance um, because I, I used to watch figure skating with my grandmother and she talked about how, oh, these figure skaters take ballet classes because it makes them elegant and graceful. And, the music spoke to me very quickly. I I always wanted to dance around the house and you know move to whatever I could hear. It's like oh, there's a rhythm to that. Let's see if I can move. Right now, I work as a general music teacher for the Washoe County School District. I'm a full-time teacher, and I teach grades pre-K through six. I have about 530 students, depending on the day, uh, but. Um, I am looking for a different challenge. I want something new, and and so there was something that had been bugging me for a while. There's a lot of arts institutions, orchestras in particular, that are they're you know going bankrupt and closing their doors, and they're going on strike because the management can't agree with the musicians, and and then there's fights with musicians' unions and different things. Why not pick? Why not have someone that? is experienced in music or dance get a training in business and be able to run it because it's a person like that that's going to understand both sides of the business I I know what the difficult decisions are going to be for the manager to say well we only have this much money to spend we have to make cuts somewhere and I also know what it's like to be the musician that's it's gonna fight for for the piece of music and say you, you want us to play this you know we need to have these people so I I, I kind of feel like I'm not just one side of the coin I actually I have both sides I started a blog to give my voice put my voice out there to others about my passions for music and dance and and to share the knowledge and the backgrounds that I have it's going really well I do the research sometimes it a lot of actually most of the time it's inspired by something that's happened recently in my life um, it's my blog I try to aim it so that those that have a background in music and dance can find value in it as well as those that are just curious about those subject areas. I try to keep my blogs you know fairly short. Um, I'm also trying to not just share my my knowledge but the knowledge of other people. I you know I include the research that I do in the blog. There's usually a couple hyperlinks so you can go out and read um, and get some more background information. You can easily contact me uh, via Twitter uh, actually my at Sarah Bartram and uh, I, I can respond to those pretty quickly. You can, if you comment on a blog post, I will get back to you. Uh, my email's on there, so you could email me. For any, anyone that has any sort of question about music or dance, I am available on just about every social media platform. Facebook, LinkedIn, Google+, Twitter, and my blog.